Alright, bear with me until we get some type of laptop or something up running for these videos, but uh, people saying they want videos again, so we'll start making some and we'll see if some money comes in, you know? We'll give it a shot. Now, we're going to talk about this. You got Marjorie Taylor Greene here. I told you, by the way, Twitter's a gold mine. I say it every day, and then people say, we ain't been making videos, I guess you can't make them anymore. I guess you... <laughs> Dumb. Fucking dumb. I've been telling you, gold mine. It's a gold mine. They're just, where's the gold? Give me the fucking gold. I'll go mine it, dummy. Now, you got Marjorie Taylor saying Merrick Garland issued a kill order for President Trump. She's a buffoon. She's definitely a buffoon. I, I, I haven't looked into it deeply. Maybe I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I believe Ed is telling the truth here when he says every single FBI search warrant issued allows for the use of deadly force if needed. Okay, because they got the um, the warrant, right? They got the warrant, so they're, they're, they're reading through that, and they're finding, oh, they're allowed to use deadly force if necessary, okay? Doesn't mean they can just go in and shoot fucking Trump. Do you really think shooting Trump is going to help liberals? It is going to, I don't know who everyone would rally around if Trump got assassinated, but there would be someone that would step up and, and he would take over the MAGA movement. And, and I think he would win because I just think that's a that's an insane move, you know. It's hard for the Democrats to be like, oh, Republicans are crazy trying to kill everybody if they did something like that. So I don't really see that happening. But uh, here's the problem, Ed. With all that said, you know, I, I know it's fun to make fun of the MAGA nerds, but with all that said, Ed, <laughs> if the tables were turned, like, uh, close your eyes with me, go with me here. If the tables was turned and they had Donald Trump as president, okay, go with me here. Donald Trump is president, all right? Everything else is exactly the same. Except Joe Biden is the one on trial. Joe Biden is the one getting raided. Trump is president. Okay? Everything else, exactly the same. All the evidence, whatever you want to talk about, trials, whatever, the same. Ed fucking Krasistan and all these other liberals would be saying the exact shit that Marjorie Taylor Greene is saying. When are you all going to realize, Ed, you're a buffoon too. Newsflash, Ed, Earth to Ed. You, I put you on the same level, Ed, as Marjorie Taylor Greene. I put you on the same level as her, Ed. You need to realize that, Ed. You need to realize you and people like you been doing shit just like this for years, and that's why we had a problem with you. That's why people had a problem with you. Because you was trying to mislead us. You was trying to bullshit us. You say right here at the top, stop misleading, Ed. I've been following you for years. You, you tried to mislead me many times about Trump, Ed. Now, let's be honest, Ed. Let's be fair about it, Ed. I've caught you many times trying to bullshit me about Trump, Ed. I will say this. You're getting a little bit better. But you're still stuck on that bullshit when we see posts like this, Ed. Ed, it's people like you that got us to where we're at right now. All this lying, misleading bullshit. You played a role in it, Ed. So take some accountability for what you've done. It's people like you that got Marjorie Taylor Greene elected, Ed. You, you helped her more than anyone, Ed. People like you helped Marjorie more than anyone. So pat yourself on the back. Don't complain that she's in power. You put her in power. How'd you do it? Lying. Misleading. People catch on after a while. And guess what? Guess what? They don't trust you no more. And then they start trusting goofs like Marjorie Taylor Greene. And eventually, they'll figure out Marjorie Taylor Greene's a lying-ass goof too. And then guess what? They won't vote for nobody. Great job, Ed. You're really saving democracy. Jesus.